How come you didn't get transfixed by her boobs, Nate Munger? She's an alien. <laughs> okay, so Hate Munger's gay. <laughs> All my fellas, or should I say brothers, today we have a wonderful video from the boys at Flash Kids with a completely, totally unrelated, not at all inspired in any way whatsoever to 40k. <laughs> This is Space King. I was waiting a long time to see the full version of the tease that we got some months ago and it's finally ready and I'm excited for it. But guys, before we get into it, of course you would have watched the original content or else you wouldn't be here. But I highly recommend that you go at least and show them some love by liking the video if you haven't already because this is obviously not a substitute to the main thing so please do that. That being said, let us dive into the sheer man that, that they have in store for us. <laughs> it's just starting like the last one, huh? Recruit me. <laughs> Little girls, <laughs> they got cooties. We can't deal with them. The positive thing about this is that the success rate in creating new aspirants who then finally becomes marines or I'm not quite sure which term they want to use for this one uh, is about 100%. They don't have to cast them in a pit to make sure that uh, they fight each other to see who survives or put them in environments that are quite deadly to them or coffin. Um, yeah, this is good. <laughs> Spinning balls. Captain. Nice. How's the interrogation going? I guess it's out the towel. Doctor, please get involved. Captain, I don't have long. I can't bear an important message. Turn back on your radio. You turned our videos off? Listen, Bryce. I don't need high command, yammering in my ear while I'm trying to find a goddamn artifact. It's okay, Captain. I just made this. It'll let him speak our tongue. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is hilarious. This is the most 40k thing that I've ever seen. <laughs> Who needs the advice of high command? We gotta create a full on genocide before we get to do anything else first. Boys, more killing. <laughs> 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 
breathe. <laughs> genocide. <laughs> no, I've had enough. I'm gonna genocide bomb the whole planet. There are 20 billion souls on this planet. Well, I know it would be kind of sweet to wipe them all out with one bomb. We could use my translator device to interrogate them all first. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Let's ask High Command. Yeah, just keep poking them in the head. Right. Thanks, Bryce. <laughs> well, I guess I'll turn the radios back on. Oh no. He's not bombing. Get him off the Get him off the Oh good, you turned your radio back on. You're on the wrong planet. Yeah, actually, uh, technically you're supposed to be on a moon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm posing. Oh, the music there is so soothing. Can you... Isn't it kind of ironic? Some of the most soothing tunes in video games and of course in literature that I've heard in a while has come from 40k. That's just something... <laughs> almost say angelic about it with the, the the way that they compose the songs it's nice but at the same time of course kind of the dichotomy of it being featured with like murder scene all the time is kind of hilarious <laughs> you're in so much trouble not only do you have one of the worst artifact recovery rates of any reclaimer squad in the galaxy, now you're wasting precious genobombs too! I wouldn't say it was a waste. Quiet, Hatemonger, or I'll send you back to your own legion. Hatemonger. It's not my fault Bryce didn't read the brief like I ordered. Plus, who cares about stupid artifacts? We should be out there, cracking heads, finding Space King. Space King will return to us when we've proven our worth. It's no wonder Space King left. Hell, I would have left too if I had you as my sons. The Emperor. <laughs> what ails you, my son? Is that all you want from me, Space King? <laughs> to retrieve artifacts? No, that's retarded. <laughs> you should be out there, cracking heads, finding Space King. I have a deep purpose for you, my son. Otherwise, why would I speak to you and only you? Right. You're a good boy, and the translator device was a really great idea. <laughs> and I'll get you a castle made of hate where no one can question your statistics. <laughs> Oh Are you no. Listening? Oh no. I said you're banned from genocide. <laughs> oh man. That's all the thing, right? Every single one of them are always just searching for their dad's approval. This is pretty low accurate as far as I'm concerned. What? That's so unfair! You can't throw Geno bombs with all your problems. And seeing as the entire Star Defender Legion is deployed to the wrong planet, guess who's gonna be scouring the moon for the artifact solo? How am I supposed to search a whole moon with just my retard squad? I don't know. Use your brain. Uh oh. <laughs> God, this sucks. Oh, there it is. <laughs> well, straight to the point. Ow! Why is the artifact glowing like that? Brother, that's no mere artifact. That idol is the divinity of Space King. It's said to contain a piece of his soul. Maybe that could lead us to him. It could lead us to Space King? W what are we waiting for? Brother, wait! It reeks of an alien in here. It's okay. They really have the we'll brains of children. Him. That makes sense that they use those tactics. Tyranids or <clears throat> space bugs. Finally, I have waited millennia. 
Of course. Of course. Of course, this is what they went with. <laughs> Jesus. Space King stole energy is mine. Lest you meet my demands. God damn. Death to the alien. Not so fast. Witness my power. Whoa. <laughs> Hate bunker. Transfixed by her boobs, Hate Monger. She's an alien. <laughs> okay, so Hate Monger's gay. <laughs> Not necessarily. He just hates women. <laughs> oh my god, he's literally in his name. Which means he'll be able to avoid her not gay. <laughs> I just hate aliens. I mean, me too, but I mean. Come on. <laughs> wow. You know, she's still gonna die. So, That's some Austin like, Powers shit. Calm down, hey, Walker. No, brother. She's drawing Space King's soul energy into her body. If we kill her while his soul is in her body, wouldn't that also be like killing him ourselves? Hey, Walker, are you, are you suggesting we can't? Kill the alien. <laughs> I didn't want to have to blast you, little star defender. I just want to talk. Shoot the tentacles. We all saw the raw power of her cannons. I think we're just gonna have to negotiate, guys. Plus, she does seem pretty cool and intelligent for an alien. Ta da! Please. No forward with the No, here's the plan. We sever her arms. Surely Space King won't mind if we kill just a couple arms worth of him. Hey, Mugger, you go left. Get her back turned so Bryce and I are tricked by her back tits and can go to work. Just not stay here. I want to go too. Let's go! No. Yep. Maybe we do need to negotiate. <laughs> you can't exterminize us everything. I know you hate me and my innovative ideas. <laughs> but I was totally right. We can't blast our way out of this one. You gotta at least see what she wants. Tick tock, Star Defender! I don't hate you, Bryce. I just think you're stupid! Oh. But. Maybe not this time. And maybe. If I'd stop to listen. And nurture that occasionally. You would be less stupider. Eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds Thanks, pretty gay. <laughs> Wait, you'll need this. It's Probably translator. the only way you'll be able to untangle her complicated emotions. Thanks, Bryce. I'll see you again, oh captain, my captain. <sighs> How did they extract gene seeds from from these guys? Come to negotiate. Your space king drove my race to near extinction once. Okay. Awesome. I understand. Your kind has always been the primary food source for mine. Conflict was inevitable, but space king pushed us back. And so, we had to switch to a nutritious diet of fruits and berries and find another dimension to live in peace. Unfortunately, I could not join my kin and have been trapped here for 3,000 years. Wait. Oh my god, please get to the port! I wish to be with my kin, 
I cannot open the portal to their dimension. My pups are too weak to make the journey. Bruh. They need my precious milk. And as you can see from my severely depleted breasts, cracks and berries are not enough to fill them. They can get All bigger. I ask, Star Defender, is you give me a snack from your globulus so I may replenish my milk and take my babies to be with my kin. I'm so sorry. sorry. They're the only things nutritious enough. You said you've come to negotiate. Please, it's for my children. If I do this, you'll return Space King's soul energy? Yes. Uh, chestnut, give me the Globulus. But uh, I'm supposed to protect them. It's for Space King, Chestnut. But I guess it's... it's your call. Yikes. Mm. <laughs> oh, thank you, Star Defender. I I'm going to quickly feed the kids and, and I'll be out of your hair. Wait, is that the movie soundtrack? Sure, Space King is proud of us. There was no other way. Maybe he'll send us a su Oh my god! Look out! Great, you smashed the artifact. What now? And killed your bull. <laughs> god damn it. Oh, Captain, my Captain. No, no, of course, of course, of course, is there not? Extraction complete. Speed to space, King. <laughs> I beg your pardon. extract holy globules, place a delicate yet religious pinch around tip of sacred membrane and lift. Oh. Holy globule extraction initiated. Extraction complete. Congratulations. Boy, I sure hope me and the boys here can find you someday, Space King. Bruh. <laughs> okay. Tired of all your media being filled with the lamest shit possible? Want a show that doesn't hate your male power fantasies, but embraces them? <laughs> There's plenty of independent animation targeted at mentally ill teenage girls. But what about hey. mentally ill teenage boys? And 30-year-old men. Don't we matter too? Wait, wait, Sp wait, wait, hold on. Hell of a boss is also for... boys... and adults. <laughs> but yeah, I get the point. <laughs> Men and boys are too retarded. Space King thinks so. Tell them about the boobies. <laughs> yes, that's right. What you just saw was the clean version of the video. There yeah. exists another version. A better, uncensored version. The true version. And maybe the last episode of Space King we ever make. No, my boobies. 
Because we're not willing to sell this show to Hollywood for them to turn into dog shit like everything else. Nah. So support us on Patreon! And we'll turn every dollar to making more episodes of Space King, untouched and uncensored. And in return, we'll give you goodies, gifts, rewards, trinkets, production updates, and most importantly, more Space King. <laughs> we cannot fund more episodes without you. Well, Link in the description. time to head on Patreon again. <laughs> I mean, in a way, the Haspian Hotel slap there was kind of making sense since Marines are supposed to do that to demons. Yet yeah, still, it, it was kind of off left field, you know? Yeah, just a great debut for uh, the series. I wish them the best. I'm definitely going to be supporting them on Patreon and I hope that you will too, at least if you have the means for it. That being said, guys, thank you so much for checking out this animation, which has absolutely nothing to do with Warhammer. So, uh, GW. Get your bloody grubs off these boys. That being said, we should all have a wonderful day. See you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye.